Hey everybody, it's Callie here from the Ontario SPCA and I'm joined with the awesome Candice. She's over in our Aurelia Animal Center. Candice, how's it going? Good, how are you doing? Doing good, doing good. Thank you so much for joining good. me today. So today, Candace, I want to just uh, chat with you a little bit. Um, you know, I want to hear kind of what's going on. I want to know a little bit about you and kind of what's going on at the center. So, you know, just to, I guess, kind of kick things off. Can you tell me a little bit about yourself? You know, um, how long have you been with the organization, um, with Aurelia, and, uh, you know, kind of what got you into this uh, line of work? So I started here about four years ago. Um, I absolutely love it. I went to school for vet tech. Um, I do not work here as a vet tech. I work here as just casual staff. <laughs> um, it's great though. I love it so much. It's my dream job. I started here as part time in the summer and I fell in love with it and I knew I was never leaving. <laughs> so <laughs> this is a great job to have and staff here are wonderful and the animals here are great. <laughs> so it's awesome. Oh, I love to hear that. Talk to me a little bit about what's going on over at Aurelia. So right now, um, it's really different for us. It's a, we've been doing split shifts with staff. So I haven't seen a few of the staff here in quite some time because we're on opposite shifts, which is kind of sucks because I'd like to see them. But uh, the animals here are having so much fun because we are just constantly walking the dogs and enriching the cats and giving them treats and playing. And they're having so much fun. And although we're not open to the public, we're making the best of it because we have so much extra time to enrich the animals and make them have more fun, more treats, more walks. And they're becoming better. Like we've had, we've had dogs that were a little bit more shy. They're not shy anymore. <laughs> they are outgoing because we work so closely with them. We have the time now, so it's wonderful. Maybe if anything, you know, when we are able to open our doors to the public um, and, and start to get animals adopted out, uh, it's only going to be more beneficial because now many, as you're mentioning, these dogs are being socialized and, uh, you know, they'll be maybe yeah. a little bit more um, with a bit more training and that kind of thing. So that's only a positive. Yeah, it's great. It's great. It's, I'm excited to open to the public. I'm going to probably talk everybody's ear off when they walk in. <laughs> so excited to see different people. But it's great too, because now that we have all these dogs, we've tried them with each other to see if they like each other. And we have dogs here that absolutely love each other. So it's great going into a new home. We can say they love other dogs. They're going to do great going on hikes and going to the dog park and that kind of stuff. So it's really important that we're learning this kind of stuff because it's going to help us place them into the perfect home for them. You guys are awesome. You're doing the best work right now. And I think it's fair to say that this is probably part of why we all got into this is just to care for the animal, yeah. do the best we can. And I think you guys are doing awesome. So you rock. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> so do you have any particular animals, Candace, that you've been working with? Um, any animal that comes to mind that you've spent maybe extra time with or that really stands out in your mind? There's a few cats we have here right now. Um, they're the orange crew. We have four lovely orange little tabbies. I don't know if you can hear them playing behind me. I'm in the cat gazebo right now because I thought if I open the door, I let them run in here. And they are so much fun. They, I've never in my life met cats that are this, they just want love and to cuddle and to play. And they're so much fun. I think you're having more fun than the cats. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Well, thank you so much, Candace. You know what? I'm so happy to hear that everybody there is doing so well, that the animals are doing yeah. well. I, of course, send all of my love, thanks, and hellos to everybody there that's working so hard to take care of the animals because we couldn't do it without you guys. So thank you. Aw, thank you. <laughs> we'll talk soon, Candace, and thanks again so much. Say hi to everybody for me. Take care.